the weather to be. It's you been know, unbelievable. I'm sure it takes a long time to plan something <laughs> right. like this. And months in advance, mm -hmm. this is exactly what the doctor would order. Right. So we are in fine shape. It's and been nice. That's, that's the great news about uh, this time of year. This is what we hope for. And uh, this is something that's going to persist into the weekend. So get ready, get set. I think I like to call this uh, putting the weather in cruise control. That's a live look at the waterfront as we look at the uh, top temp today. Made it up to 77 degrees today in Buffalo. A cool morning low of 57. Sun will set at 821 p.m. Let's talk about your weather headline. Shapes up this way. Uh, much like uh, Last night, tonight brings more moonlight and, of course, the most reliable meteor shower of the year. The Perseid meteor shower producing some beautiful shooting stars getting to the open countryside away from uh, the bright lights of the city. And you should be able to catch a falling star or two. The weekend brings ample amounts of sunshine. Early next week, maybe some widely scattered showers, but really nothing that will put a huge dent in the rainfall deficit, which we'll talk more about at 530. Here's your evening planner. Maybe you want to get the grill out. Good to go or maybe head to the fair. Temperatures into the 70s, dropping slowly into the 60s. There is that fair forecast for Saturday. Just a touch warmer with an ample amount of sun, as I mentioned, and comfortably mild heading into, uh, say, around the dinner hour. And that muggy meter is still in check. Dew point temperatures way down there in the comfy zone. They might start to spike a little bit early next week, but not by much. In fact, the humidity now at 29% in Buffalo. That's just about some of the driest air you can get around these parts. Sevens are wild right now. Seven 77 degrees, that breeze coming in out of the north. Bubble of high pressure means no trouble weather-wise. The leading edge of warm air back to the west, producing some showers out towards Chicago. Uh, those should stay to our west, but you're going to notice a little bit more cloud cover as that front makes its way a little bit closer tomorrow. Right now, though, you're hard pressed to find a cloud across all of western New York from hilltop to Lakeshore. Just a few lonesome cumulus clouds which have just added to the beauty of our sky. Once the heating of the day goes away, they go poof and the sky is clear overnight. There will be some high clouds coming in tomorrow morning. Again, we'll call it a mixed bag of clouds and sunshine for your Saturday. And again, temperatures just a little bit higher. There is the leading edge of some of that uh, warmer air and a disturbance that's going to be tracking to the south. This particular model wants to crank out a shower or two for Sunday afternoon. I don't buy it. If we see a sprinkle, that's it. So the call for Tonight, it's uh, mainly clear, comfortable. The moon will rise shortly after 9 o'clock. The overnight low temperature 53, and it's a waning gibbous now. Not the uh, full sturgeon moon, but uh, uh, just barely full. Tomorrow, sun and a few clouds, pleasantly warm. Your top temp at 80. There's your super seven-day forecast. Of course, we've got the big Bills game tomorrow as well. Good to go there weather-wise. Maybe an isolated shower later Sunday. Nothing to cancel plans over. And again, perhaps a touch unsettled as we head towards later Monday night and Tuesday. And we'll be right back. Stay with us.